I don't really have one word, but uh, I just knew that uh, it was a, a good team. Um, I played Malaga uh, when I was with Santa Vita, and they ended up winning Euro Cup that year. So I knew it was a good club. I knew they had good players. And um, my coach in Santa Vita, Velco, had played here before, so he used to always talk about Malaga, how beautiful of a city it was. So I had some expectations about how nice it was, and I already knew it was a good club. So. Uh, when I got here and actually seen it for myself, I was really happy to be here. Um, you know, really excited to come. Um, the players are all great guys. Um, you know, they welcomed me uh, with open arms, and I jumped right in, and uh, the ball was rolling right away. Bueno, lo que dice es que ya conocía el club, tenía muy buena información. Dice que su entrenador de Chavita, Selco, Messi, como bien sabéis, pues que siempre hablaba bien de, de Málaga y que desde el primer momento que, que llegó él tenía muy buenas sensaciones de poder venir, estaba contento, ilusionado y que bueno, pues todo el mundo lo ha recibido con los brazos abiertos y que desde el primer momento pues está sintiendo uno más del, del grupo. Um, I can't remember if I played Brian or not, but me and Kyle have been playing against each other since we were little. Um, we were the same All-American camps in high school, the same AAU tournaments and stuff like that. So I've definitely played Kyle. Um, I don't think I played anybody else though. Dice que desde pequeño está coincidía en los equipos de All-American y, y que cree, no tiene mucho recuerdo muy seguro, pero cree que seguramente pues con, con Brian al haber compartido esos momentos sería lo único con el que podría haber coincidido. Um, for, for one, um, I'm a winner. Uh, that's really all I care about is winning. Um, but if I would describe my game, uh, I would have to say exciting. Um, people like to watch me play. Uh, I play hard. I give it my all all the time. Um, I got a lot of heart. Uh, and I mean, that, that's really it. As long as we win the ball game, that's all I care about. <laughs> que le gusta competir, que juega siempre con mucho, con mucho corazón, que le gusta sentir lo que hace y cree que bueno, pues es lo que un poco le, le define mejor. Yeah, all of them, obviously. Uh, you know, Euro Cup is probably the biggest. Um, probably the name is more important to the fans and, and the players. Uh, so we definitely like to win uh, Euro Cup, but you know, the Spanish league is a great league also. Um, we got a lot of good teams in it. Um, has a lot of, it gets a lot of respect from other leagues around the world, especially in America. Um, so, you know, I was excited to be to come here and play in that league. Dice que bueno, todas eh, todas las ligas, como te comentaba, que quizás de cara a los aficionados la que pueda tener más nombres la la Eurocup, pero que sabe que desde la liga inglesa también tiene mucho respeto desde otras ligas y está muy bien considerada como bueno, bueno está ilusionado de poder disputar todas ellas. Um, I used to wear so. Uh, my AAU team uh, growing up, well, the biggest team was uh, Derrick Rose All-Stars, and the best player used to have to wear number one because Derrick wore number one. Um, so, I mean, and, and it was the only number available. I normally wear number three, but Jaime has number three. Que también dependía de los números que había libres, ¿no? Y cuando le escribí el, el mensaje, él quería el, el tres, que ya lo tenía ocupado Jaime. Y entonces, bueno, le gustaba el número uno, pues no por lo que puede, las connotaciones que puede tener el número uno, no significa el número uno, pero tampoco, tampoco va más allá. Um, I was really excited. Uh, it was early in the morning. Um, I almost didn't answer the phone um, because it was so early, but something told me to answer it, and um, it was great news, so I'm glad I answered it. Um, so I was really excited. Um, I didn't have to think about it really at all, um, and I was playing in the D League, and I was kind of over. Um, playing in that league and, and trying to get in the NBA. Uh, so, you know, I wanted to, to come overseas, but I didn't want to just take any job.
Um, I wanted to wait it out and, and try to get a good job and a good league where it was worth it. And once I got this call, it was a no-brainer. Dice que fue una llamada muy temprano en el, por la mañana que estuvo a punto de, de no responder, pero la gente insistió y que cuando vio el interés pues tampoco le tomó mucho tiempo tomar la decisión, que estaba muy ilusionado, sabe que estaba allí en la Liga de Desarrollo esperando alguna opción de NBA, pero el tener otra vez una opción overseas de, de venir a Europa, como suele decirse, pues que le representaba una muy buena opción y, y pensó que era el momento de volver.